Old two-prong outlets, ungrounded, unsafe, difficult to plug your appliances into. You need to upgrade to a GFI safety outlet. Let's get to it. Okay, we have verified the power is off in this older house. Simply take off the cover plate. A GFI outlet is considered improved safety over an ungrounded outlet because it does have a mini type of a circuit breaker built into the device that will turn off the power if it senses a problem. The GFI outlet is the only three prong outlet that even on an ungrounded service will be approved by your building authority, the National Electrical Code, and often your rental authority. It does improve the safety even though it does not have grounding in the older houses you can still install it with the proper labeling included in the kit. The new GFI outlet actually has a pressure plate behind each screw, so it does not need a hook or a curved wire. You just want a straight wire on the new one. Okay guys, it doesn't matter if you have one set of black wire and white wire or two sets. If you have two sets, it simply means it's continuing the power to another outlet. The way we're gonna install this GFI outlet is we're just protecting this individual outlet. You can put as many of these in your older home as you want. You can do one at every single outlet. Um, this yellow tape by the manufacturer covers the load side. That would be downstream protection to other outlets in the house. In this application, we're actually gonna run everything just to the line side. So only this outlet is protected, um, which is what you want because of the changing from the two prong to the three prong. Um, and we do need straight wires here behind the pressure plate. So instead of straightening this out, which is kind of a nightmare and doesn't work well, we're actually gonna strip this wire, cut it and re-strip the wire. This is 14 gauge. You might have slightly thicker 12 gauge, which is a 20 amp circuit. This outlet will work for either one. Okay, the way that this one is designed, it does have a pressure plate to receive up to two wires. The brass B screw side goes to the black wire. Straight in right behind the pressure plate. It's a really good design, easy to use. Nice and tight, and then the neutral side is the silver screw, so that's your white wire. Okay, and those are nice and tight. Okay, now you're ready to go in. It does require a rectangle type cover plate, not the traditional two type. Okay, in the box, they do provide these convenient stickers. The National Electrical Code does require that you label the outlet as no equipment ground provided because even though it's three prong and it's safer and more convenient for you, we still don't have a ground wire because it's an older house. So this little detail is required. You put on the provided label, turn the power, you're good to go. Okay guys, so if you do the factory test, it will trip, cut the power, you have a safe outlet there. Um, however, if you test, it will still show as open ground, no ground provided, which we knew because it's an older house with no ground wire. I bet you can do it yourself.